What is up everybody? Chlorine King here. Thanks for tuning in for another video. This short video is going to help show you if your i -Core flow switch is going bad. And so what you need to do is go in Diagnostic Menu and how you do that is you just hold more for a couple seconds. You'll see all the lights blink and then we'll get into the Diagnostic Menu. You can see here by in the Diagnostic Menu you got the hours ran, the temperature, the salt, you know, stuff like that, the version. But what I want you to pay attention to is the temperature. You see that? It's 118 degrees. So there's no way the water temperature is 118 degrees. So with it reading that hot is an indicator that the flow switch is going bad, so it needs to be replaced. Um, and then once you don't press anything for a while, it goes back to normal operation. Ironically, the salt system next door is also having an issue, so another way to tell is by the salt reading. So you can see here, the temperature is good, but the salt is 1506. Now I just tested with my own meter and it's at 3700 on my own meter, which is consistent with past readings. So having a terribly inconsistent or significantly lower salt reading is another way. And as long as that red cell light's not blinking or it doesn't display cell here, uh, that'd be a good indicator. It's just a flow switch in most cases. That is a quick video on how to show the flow switch going bad. Stay tuned for more videos, like and subscribe, and we'll see you next video. Have a great day.